Hey everybody, and welcome to my channel, Creations by Christine. That's me. So today's video is all about Happy Mail. I got a whole bunch of stuff here. I got three big packages here to open up. My first order from Mary Maxim, so I'm super excited about this. But this is the one I'm most excited about. I'm covering the addresses for privacy sakes, but I will show you one thing if my camera will focus. There it is. The llama. That means it's from Miss Veronica. Steel Show Crochet and Chef. I will post her link below. I got some of her stitch markers. I was so super excited. She comes with a cute little card, complete with the llama. Oh my god, that's so cute. I'm keeping that forever. And it's got all of her information on the back. I will post all this down below. So, thank you. That's so cute. And here they are. Veronica! Oh my god. They're beautiful. I'm just going to take them out of the package. One flipped around here. They are so cute. Check this out. Oh, come on. Let's see if I can. Well, he's red anyway. So flip. There we go. Those are so cute. So shiny. So that's long. Oh, I got a bunch. Can't help it. My skulls. This is super cool. Kind of hard to show you in the lighting, but this one's like super shiny. Come on, spin your little bead. There he is. Oh. There. Can't really see his face. Yeah, no. He's not really showing. But he's super cute. The white ones aren't showing up too well. I got more skulls though. Right here. I got her buy three, get the fourth one free package. These are the ones that I love the most. Oh yeah. Chromed out skulls. Those are so awesome. I'm gonna use those tonight. And last but not least, we have the ones I got from my puppy. Little bone. Let me see if I can get it. Focus there, a little bone and a little doggy paw. And this one just says live on it. Because that's what we wake up every morning to do. Live. I just love them. Thank you so much, Veronica. I love them. Love them, love them, love them. Mwah. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to go to this one next. Because I don't know what it is. But it's for me. So. Open this up real quick. Alright. Oh, guys, 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 guys. Oh, it's the rest of my ice yarn. Oh, my goodness. And the extra ball that she found of my violino that I'm making my summer top out of. This stuff is really crazy. It's like rope. Like, I'll show you. It's flat. Super flat. And it twists when you work with it, so whatever. I still love it. Alright, so this is what I got. Oh, wow. That's amazing. And it even comes in a cute little bag. Check that out. So cute. And yeah, this stuff is the normal. It's called Fettuccina Fine. And it's kind of the same stuff, but it's smaller. I don't know. I love it though. And I got three. Four, 
five, six, seven, eight balls. Okay. Get rid of the noisy packaging. Okay. Yeah. Eight balls. I'm excited. That is amazing. They're all the same color. And I also got. Sorry, packaging is driving me crazy. Um, the same style, but it's called Fettuccina Cotton Cotton AC Cotton Naka. Hold on, let me see. I'll show it to you. That label's kind of worn down. Well, they're all kind of worn down. But it's a cotton acrylic blend. And I have got seven. Seven balls of white. That would make like the cutest purse, would it not? Or something. Yeah. So sweet. <laughs> and there's 16 balls of yarn, including this guy here. Which I am almost done my summer top. I'm hoping to be wearing it for my life tomorrow. So I don't know, we'll see. And this is a cute little bag. Wool, wool warehouse. Cool. Alright. This is my Mary Max in the morning. See? I'm just not showing you where I live. Because I don't want you to come to my house. I mean, I love you guys. Call you my fan. But we gotta kind of draw a line there, you know? Okay. I gotta get this noisy part over with. Look at that. This is my Millens. I paid $10 a piece for these Millens. Now, Bag of Day, Crystal, I will link her below. Um, I always do this one. I'm going to link something below. So that's the point. Um, Bag of Day Crochet. If you don't know her, you need to know her. She is like the Pope of Crochet on YouTube. Anyways, we all love her. I'm not going to compare her to a religious figure, but the same. She's pretty important. So she released a video on Millens. And if you don't know what Millens are, they are basically um, balls that are underweight, overweight, um, misshapen when they're wound. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the product. It's just, it's not the, that quality of... For, to sell at full price. So here I got three skeins. There's three skeins in there and it's a pink to purple rainbow. So I'm just gonna, just gonna open this up. And it's definitely a cotton yarn, which is awesome because, well, first off it said cotton mill ends. But um, there's the colors there. Just trying to get the camera to focus a little more. It's really hard. I don't know why my lighting is so terrible. Um, it's like a pink and purple sort of color. There, now you can kind of see it. There's no white in it. I don't know why it's showing up white. Um, I'll put pictures. I'll see if I can get like a more of a true color shot of it. Or maybe I'll insert one somehow. Okay, so I got two. I also got a green, like a teal, pretty teal green. Um, again, cotton. And uh, I'm so excited. These were so cheap. Like, they're so inexpensive. And that's the color green there. I'm just trying to get a different lighting on it here. It's not really working too well. It is green. I promise you it's green. So I got three balls of that as well. I got a lot of work to do. I love working with cotton yarn. Cotton yarn is great for dishcloths. Uh, that's basically the only thing I use in my kitchen is my little cotton dishcloths. Um, it's just a double crochet dish, di double crochet dishcloth. Try saying that three times fast. It's a double crochet dishcloth. Got it. <laughs> and. Um, 
I actually recently wanted to make the little like tea towel holders with the buttons on them that because uh, I really want one on my fridge handle and um, so I guess that's what I'm going to be making is some dish towels, dishcloths, holy yarn. I'm going to see if I can hold all this up for you guys. Let me see. The struggle is real with this one. Alright. For convenience sake, because I'm not a spider, I'm going to put these two back in here. And so, we have two pounds of Mary Maximilians that I paid $19.98 for. I used a coupon for free shipping. But, okay, so that's that. And then this stuff, like I mentioned, if you guys haven't watched my other Happy Meal video, I'll link it down below. And I got a bunch of these. So she found one more. And then she gave for free another six fifteen oh I say fifteen? Fourteen fifteen oh there goes one. Can you hear you? Alright. There it is. I can hold it all. I am one happy girl right now. I am going to put this down. Cause I can't hold these all on my legs. So they jingling. This one's upside down. Now I don't have hands. Oh, the camera's kind of picking it up now. There it is. You can kind of see his face. See him? So cool. That one on this far side, like right there. So cool. And then his little white buddy on the other side. Holy yarn. Okay. I'm going to go crochet. Um. I just want to make a quick mention before I take off. Um, I do have my very first live coming up on Sunday. That is the 16th at 3 p.m. I'll come hang out for a little bit. I don't know, probably about a half hour, hour. It's my first live. I kind of really don't know what to expect. Um, I've got some news. Um, actually, some big news. Um, giveaway related. So stay tuned for that. Um, Again, another mention, I have heard from Jen Reeves. She's now won her, like, dozenth giveaway, and she has... Oh, I'm dropping stuff. And she has gotten in touch with me this morning, and she has claimed her prize. So the giveaway is officially done. Um, whichever she chooses out of the two options, um, I am going to put into my next giveaway. So stick around, and I hope you guys enjoyed my little Happy Meal haul here. Um, I'm so pumped. I have so much stuff to do now. Um, the sun's just going down. It's a beautiful day. Um, I'm going to get out there and enjoy the last little bit of the sunshine with the family and sit and crochet. So